What's happening guys, my name is Alex and welcome to the first Photoshop tutorial of the day. In this video, I'm going to show you guys how to use a brush tool. So let's say you have a picture and you, and you want to draw something on it and you want to have like, uh, like a line with a fade or like a solid fade. I'm going to show you guys how to do that right now. And it's going to be really simple. I'm just going to show you guys how to use the brush tool. It's really simple though. And I would say that I'm straight into the actual video. Okay, guys. So as you guys can see, I just opened a thumbnail of After Effects, as you can see right here. And what I'm going to do now is I'm going to show you guys how to use the brush tool. So, so first of all, you want to pick this one, this little brush icon. You want to click on that. And then, and then basically you can actually choose how thick you want your lines to be and everything I'm going to show you guys right now. So we're going to start off at the top on this little menu as you can see. So right here you can choose the thickness of your of your icon as you can see right there. It's really simple though. Right here you can choose the thickness. You can also choose if you want to have like a solid one or like a fade as you can see right there. It's like a fade and the other one is just solid as you can see right there. Right here you can choose what kind of effect you want. So let's say we want to have a uh, fade one. You want to have it a little bit small. You can just hold your mouse like right here uh, so you can see how big it is. So this is actually how it's going to look. So we're going to use that one. And now we're going to change the color of this. So what you want to do is also you want to go to, down at the bottom and you see those little two icons. You just want to press on you want to press on the left top one and you want to choose your color. So let's say we are going to pick red. I'm going to click on OK. And as you guys can see, we have right here, we have a red you know, line, a red brush. So as you see right here, I just have the red brush. And I don't know, guys, you can do so many things with this. You can actually make it really big like this or like even bigger. That is like too much for the screen like this almost. That is basically how you can add like nice effects to it, nice glows. As you can see, if I do it like this, if I go to the bottom, it has like a nice, you know, glow look. If I just go, if I just go around here, as you can see, so that looks really nice actually. So that's how you can actually spice up your thumbnails. And I don't know, you tell you guys, tell me. You can choose, you know, the thickness. If it's like still like this, it like like retarded big, like you know, as you can see, like with the ball that's that tall. You can also make that solid. Uh, you just want to pick on, you know, just want to click on this one, and then as you can see, it is just a solid color, and that is basically, you know, the brush tool, the basics, and you also can choose like like different, you know, stamps or anything uh, to, you know, you can do so many things with it. You can see, you can do all lines at the same time. You have all kinds of different patterns, as you can see, like those lines, everything else, and that is basically how you can, you know, start using the brush tool. Like they have so many, they have countless things you can use. Do whatever you like. I mean, I can make this bigger and you can see that what it is. It's just, you know, it are just little stamps and it keeps going. As you can see, you just can pick so many different things and you can customize it however you want it. I don't think you can, you can stop anywhere because as you can see on the color at the left, those colors, as you can see this little bar, like this one, every color from this entire square, like from red to dark, entire this, combined all the colors in here, the fades are 16.8 million colors. So you can choose, yeah, you have 16.8 million colors to choose from. I'm going to pick a random blue one. Let's see like a light blue one. I'm going to change the actual pattern to let's say this one I'm going to make it also bigger as you guys can see we have blue stuff going around and that is basically how you can customize it guys it is that freaking simple I mean this is infinite I mean you can choose 16.8 million colors you can choose so many different patterns and sizes that's how you use a brush tool guys it's so freaking simple and I don't know you guys tell me because that is basically how you can use them you can go ahead straight away you can also choose the colors on this in this menu let's say we're going to pick the last color which is going to be just like some kind of green we want to also we will always have one green on top and as you guys can see boom we have a nice green line and then you can start actually drawing or painting or coloring anything you like and that is basically how you can use the brush tool guys it is that simple there we go so that is basically how to use brush tool guys there's so many different things you can you can do with this option and that is basically the video so that's the video guys that is how you use the brush tool it's so freaking simple i know but that is basically how simple it is make sure to smash the like button down below and also the like button you know down below if you want to see more videos and if this video was helpful to you thank you guys for watching i'll see you guys in two hours for the last photoshop tutorial of today and i will see you guys tomorrow for two premiere pro tutorials so make sure to stick around i will see you guys in two hours so until then i will see you guys very soon
It's me again. Um, I know I, I haven't uploaded a video uh, for a while on this channel. You know, all the kind of movies was a great actor uh, the past several months. Um, basically, uh, some of you may know uh, that I'm a partner with Media Crown. Let me explain. It's on the comment section down below. So I'm just gonna uh, put this completely random. Thank you guys, and I'll see you guys next week.